Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another quick pick prediction video. In this video, I'll be predicting the women's story bout between Vanessa Demopoulos versus Silvana Gomez Juarez. And hi, Steve's from right here. So this is a matchup I also have been jumping back and forth and back and forth on. Anytime you get these fighters that are just like so iffy, like flip a coin, just flip a coin. These guys, these women, these gals, these they dems, they, they iffy. And these women are iffy. Silvana Gomez Juarez is what, 0-2 in the UFC. Um... But that's the mafia. I think she went well, oh, 0-2 underneath the Zufa whatever banner. Well, I don't know. It's not even Zufa no more. It's whatever corporation. I'm saying Zufa like Zufa even a thing anymore. But or at least not with the UFC. They sold it. But either way, um, she like oh, 0-2 underneath the banner of the UFC and all affiliate organizations that they own and whatnot. I believe. But um, either way, Silvana Gomez and um Vanessa Demopoulos. I see this one. Both these women are pushing forty. Vanessa Demopoulos like what? She like. Two years from, yeah, two years from 40. And um, Vanessa Mopla is like four years from 40. So like 36 versus like 38. So both of these women are up there in the age, which is not good. That is a good look there. That is senior age, they're not spectacular in any area. Graphic, not spectacular. Strike, not graphic. Strike, compliments, not spectacular. Striking, not spectacular. Graphic, not spectacular. Fight IQ, not spectacular. They're very much whatevers. Sorry to say it, but it is the reality of things. They have not accomplished a great lot as far as they make careers and they have not shown great consistency and both kind of have records that reflect that. It's not like they have fought necessarily the greatest competition either. So, like, you can't know really how to feel about either of these women. But how I see this one is Vanessa Nopolis has shown to be the more world on the fight. I do have concerns that she likes to strike. And I think Silvana Gomez Juarez is the much, much better striker for my, you know, my my eye. She's a much better, sharper striker. And Vanessa Nopolis does not want to strike with her for too long. She wants to mix it up and be a mixed martial artist. And I have my concerns like that. A lot of times she chooses to strike, which will be a very bad and very poor fight decision for her to do. But hey, it might happen. But I guess a good look I can say for her, like she did not, she's not, don't mix it up as much as she should in her career. But in her last fight, you know, she lost to J.J. Alrich in a decently competitive fight that was clear for Aldrich, that Aldrich won. But she was very much in the fight all the way through in which, you know, a solid veteran in J.J. Aldrich. But I like the fact that she, you know, she got into zero takedown. She went for five. And five is a pretty impressive number, pretty solid number. Not to, I mean, the fact that she didn't get nothing is not impressive at all. That's actually very disappointing. But the fact that she went for five, I think she can score, if she goes for five, six, seven, or even four or three, in a close fight with with um, um with Savannah Gomez Juarez. I said Goldman Juarez. <laughs> Savannah Gomez Juarez, or whatever they don't call Juarez. Then I think that's a very good factor. Like, if she attempts takedowns, that's a very good look. Close competitive fight, maybe. Or maybe she can tie her up, maybe not score takedowns, but look to tie her up and not be getting mince, like turning to mince meat at distance or mid range and just try to stay upside, close range, clinch range, against a cage. It may work from takedowns. This could be her fight to win. And I think if she gets down to the ground, I think she can easily control the position on the ground and eke out a decision. I still think this competitive fight, I think the Moffat's going to get touched up a little bit, but I think she'll be able to score some takedowns, be able to work some cage control and like clinch her against the cage and win a very close, not the most pretty fight, but edge out a decision over. The pushing 40, 38 year old Silvana Gomez, journey woman, war. So, in this fight, I have Vanessa Demopoulos be a decision. 